previously on Making the Squad. It's absolutely terrible. The first person that will be going home is Miria. The second person is Kevin. Started with 10 contestants, two have been eliminated and sent packing. It was weird seeing them actually leave last night, you know? Yeah. Like this morning, mad quiet as well. Yeah. Like, compared to usual, where everyone's like up and about, active, talking, yeah. excited. Yeah, everyone's in that room like, <laughs> getting fresh again. Now it's real, you know? Now yeah. it's real. Yeah, it's about to go down, so yeah. The pressure is getting to some more than others. Yesterday when I was playing that game, I was feeling so frustrated with myself. Oh, and it goes! I was not comfortable with the team, so I disconnected, and that's why the, the goal difference was so, so big. And the penalty is converted! 6-1 against Peke. As much as he's my friend, I did enjoy that a lot because it allowed me to sort of get the results that I need, but also be entertaining. Pull out the Why Always Me shirt, but I like to put on a show. Well, I'd love to be a fly on the wall in that dressing room. I am on, on, the, on the deadline right now, so it gives me a punch of reality on my face. And that was so, oh, so bad. Oh, You're it's good, okay. man. You're safe, brother. After yesterday's eliminations, the leaderboard has been reset. Everybody has a clean slate, and they're safe from eviction, for now. The priority for those left would be to win the challenges and win their matches, keeping themselves out of the bottom two. For the contestants' third in Real Life Challenge, I decided to shake things up. I met them at Checkpoint Charlie, where the Berlin Wall once stood, a place that divided the city. This is the maze. Contestants need to navigate through the Hall of Mirrors and enter a four-digit code to escape. I've given them the first two numbers, but they'll have to find the other two inside the maze. Whoever does it quickest, obviously, is the winner. If they exceed the five-minute time limit, they'll be pulled from the maze. For me, it's all about vision. Mm -hmm. Vision on FIFA is like one of the most important things. <laughs> no mirrors, though. No mirrors, no mirrors in the game. Yeah. The winner of this challenge gets to decide the next head-to-head -head matches. OK, Gaffer. Cool. Does that make sense? Yes. First contender into the mirror maze is Amenya! Three, two, one, go! Oh, I can't be swearing, sorry. No, I'm at the entrance again, that's not good. Well, I'm doing the same thing over and over again. You got to remember, Amenya studies economics. He's currently doing a master's. The way his brain works compared to everybody else's here is very different. I've seen a number like on the wall, does that count? I've seen like a number three. The maze even throws off the cameraman. Well, I've got to find the exit, I'm afraid. So, unfortunately, I can't come and look for you. I see it, I see it, I see it, I see it, I see it. Did I win it? I don't know. Bang. Yo. Don't say bang like that. That was too quick. What's going exactly. on? That was... <laughs> Brother! I lost the cameraman. I don't know if that's good or bad. <laughs> I don't know what I'm <laughs> Your time was 1 minute 22 seconds. My brother, I'm love and guidance you. and good luck to you. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Thank you. Love G. Right, get out the shot then. <laughs> Next up, we have the Brixton boy. He goes by the name of The Commoner. The Commoner, are you ready? Yes, sir. Three. Two, one, let's go! Come on. Come on, leave me. Oh, I'm all that way. This is crazy.
No, I just don't have that last number. I gotta win. Win whenever I'm like in a, some sort of competition, which is why I was really annoyed at myself with the mirror mate. Like this rig, mate, you're better off packing your bags. Yeah, I'll, I'll go home. <laughs> I don't know the last number. See you back in South East London, mate. <laughs> The commoner, mate. Yeah. Make your way back round to the start. You're done. Your time's done. I just couldn't find the final number. It was there. Yeah, I know it's there. Did I know. Did I tell you where it was? Where? By the mirror. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Basti, are you ready? Yes. Three, two, one, go. Then it's gone already. Oh, you've done it! You got a time of two minutes and 50 seconds. I you've mean, absolutely yeah. smashed it. All right, all right. Take care, my friend. Cheers. What a lovely, lovely, lovely chap Basti is, isn't it? Next up, we have Jace, AKA Javon. He was the winner of the last two challenges, so that means he got to pick the last two head to heads. The question is, how are we doing this time? I uh, reckon okay, about one minute 15. Javon, are you ready? Yes, sir. Go. The strategy's got to be to find the numbers fast. Because without those numbers, we've seen people struggle. He's hitting himself so much. And the minute I get to the door, bang, get the code in, get out. Yes? Philly looked at me as if I was some crazy man. I think he said, how are you so good? Why are you so good at every damn challenge? Your time was a minute and 20 seconds. <gasps> You beat Amenya's time, which was 1 minute 22 seconds. That's crazy. <laughs> I wish you, like, you could see Amenya's face. He is livid. Amenya. It's minor. Anyone you give me, I'll bat them anyway. It's minor. It's minor. It's minor. Get this out of my face. Crunch, are you ready? I'm winning 10k, 10,000, okay? Like, put it in your head. Will allow me to help my family. You allowed me to like lift a big, massive burden off their shoulders. Three, two, one, go! Oh, okay. Oh. Hurry up, crowd. Yeah. Where are you? I don't know. Dum, dum, dum. I hit. Every single wall, mate. Uh, do you want to know? Or do you just want to go join the rest of the guys now? Yeah, I lost. <laughs> <laughs> Up next, we have Rusky. He's in his homeland, so the pressure is on. Three, two, one. Woo! Immediately had a plan uh, how, I, how, how I'm going to approach this because they gave us the first two numbers. I'm going straight to the to the to the keypad and try my best to uh, guess the other two numbers. No. What's up? Ha! <laughs> and it went really well. Up next, we have Judy. Judy, are you ready? Yes! Three, two, one. What I need to do, I know what the reality is, and I know that I'm, I'm, I don't want to be the next. I don't want to be one more time on that deadline. So I will fight, I will play, I will do everything. Okay. Oh my God, bro, I'm so lost inside. My this. mind can be on that position one more time. Oh my gosh, what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> I believe oh, I'm Judy, it. mate, you are awful at this. No, no, no. Four minutes now, Judy. One more minute and you're getting out of there by default. <laughs> My brother, uh, your score doesn't even... Your score, <laughs> doesn't, your score doesn't even matter. Uh, you've done it I five know. minutes. You take care, mate. Go join the rest of the guys. Thank you. Up next, we have a wave guru. Rosie, are you ready? Yeah. Un, du, toi. Yeah. I don't know if there's a strategy you can have for the mirror maze, in all honesty. You can't have a strategy, because it just mirrors everywhere. 
Unless you just do that. Actually, that's a strategy. I'll take that back. You know what I mean? Arms out. Come on. I'm lost, though. I'm gonna, give, I'm gonna give him four seconds. Oh, you're so bad. No, you, you was no gonna... it's not the good you time. You got the fastest time. You lying, oh, no. man. <laughs> <laughs> you're just a lying, man. The IRL challenge is done. It's time to reveal the fastest rap from the maze. So guys, Mirror Maze, how was it? Did you enjoy it? Yeah, it was good. Who hurt themselves? Elbows out and just running about. Oh, is that what you was doing? Yeah, yeah. That's a oh. I was shot, so shoulder thing on the side. That's what something you saying. So, Amenya in third place got a time of 1 minute 22 seconds, and Jason in second place got a time of 1 minute and 20 seconds. So that means your winner, with a time of 57 seconds, My is best friend! Guys, any I question it. though, he's from Berlin, so he could have come and done this Definitely. already. No, no, no. Yeah, what do you think? Like, the game is the game. No, 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 the game is the game. No, 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 no. Use it to your advantage. Game is okay, the game. So, Rusty, you know how it works by now. I know, um, the winner of the challenge gets to decide who goes head to head in the dome. So, when you're ready. After I won the challenge, I've immediately started to think what is going to happen next, but it was hard to choose. Uh, who's gonna go against who? I think, I think, I think I'm going with my brother Peke. Okay. And. Um, oh my God. Right. So you guys stand head to head. All right, all right. I put myself against Peke because I think we're quite on the same level. I'm trying to go as far as I can in this competition, so I'm gonna pick someone who's on my level. Second match, Amenya. Yes, sir. Against. Oh. Crunchy. Okay. Oh. Come on, come on, come on. If Crunch has a good day, he can he can beat Amenia. All right, the third pick is going to be Basti against my man, the commoner. Oh! At the end of the day, I'm I'm confident with my FIFA abilities that whoever I put up uh, I'm put up against, I can get the result I need. So by default, the last game will be Will Rosé versus Jace, a.k.a. Javor. I put the strongest against the strongest and the, the weakest against the weakest, so there's like a good chance that one of the good players is uh, going to leave this competition. Size up your opponent, remember how he plays, and take that into the next game. Hey, a quick question though, boss. Are we going to see you take on the mirror maze yourself or not? Come on, you got yeah. it. Yeah. 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 I'd love to, but look, just push that. Nah, brother, I don't. No, 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 no. My elbows ain't good. You I got a note for that? Yeah, I'll just, I'll just yeah. get it off camera. Come on, no, 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 no. <laughs> They'd managed to escape the maze, but there was no getting away from 1v1s. It was match day, so I thought I'd pay them a surprise visit. What's happening, lads? You joining one of the biggest esports gaming companies of the world is about being screwed on at any point given. Mm -hmm. You need to be able to play in any situation, in any arena that you're given or presented. Yes, Gaff. So, the games today will be played in the Pringle Room. Finish your soups. Oh We're gonna go downstairs and get going straight away. Oh, nice. Wow. Okay. Let's get it. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh. You, you seem ready, Rusky. Um, I am ready. Yeah. yeah. Always. Okay. Cool. Always ready. Everyone needs that mentality. Yeah. Um, so I hope everyone's ready, and I'll see you downstairs in the next two minutes. Yes, this isn't the dome but I'm curious to see how they handle the added pressure of being closely surrounded by their competition. Slap twist. That's I like that. New one. I've also introduced another twist to force them to keep their composure or buckle under pressure. So guys, what's happening? You good? Yeah. I'm seeing these hands. Everyone does these <laughs> ones. Like Today we'll be doing house rules. As you know, house rules are whatever you say they are, but in this case, it's whatever I say they are. So, the one rule I've decided to go for is first to three goals wins. That means you really have to go for it, yeah? You get to pick your own teams. And how we're gonna do that is based on yesterday's challenge results. Brusky, you are the winner. 
You get to pick first. I think I'm going with Chris G. Jason, you were second yesterday, so that means you get the second pick. Yeah, I'm going to go for Liverpool. I'm going to go against my roots and I'm going to pick Manchester United. Ooh, Manchester City. I am going to go for Real Madrid. Okay. I'm going to go with uh, Tottenham. Oh, wow. I will beat Barcelona. I'm going to have to go with Bayern just for the all round team play. Is everyone feeling confident? Yeah. Me. Yeah, I looked at Santi straight away because I didn't hear nothing from him. Our first match of the day is Rusky versus Pepe. I think the two people that will leave at the next round are maybe myself and probably Peke. If he has a good day, he can beat me. If I have a good day, I can beat him. Yeah, that's why I chose him. And we have a fun format to bring you today. First team to score three wins. Let's go, brother. Let the games begin. A real opening now. Big chance it is. A truly magnificent start. Peke took the lead, scoring after just five minutes. What a start. When you score the first goal, you disconnect a little bit your opponent and you, you have this comfortable moment. You can prepare better your tactics for the rest of the game. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Peke looked solid in defence. Nice try, nice try, bro. Ruski found a way back in. While still searching for the equaliser. It's gone in! A goal for PSG! A great team goal. To square things up. And a foul. Okay. Oh, it was it was <laughs> what can they do from this free kick situation? Ah, it was so close! After that missed opportunity from Peke, Ruski had a chance of his own. This was intense stuff. What? And we're inside the final 30 minutes. Can he finish? Oh. Second half, and there was another great chance for Ruski. And level it is in the waning moments. Hey! He tries to kill him. <laughs> and that's full time. 1-1. One, one. How do you think that went? It's so hard to play here for the concentration, for be focused on the game. Roski, you um, won the challenge and you got to pick the head-to-head. -head. I've picked them because I, oh, I kind of expected this. It's on the same level. It went how I thought it was going to, going to go. Our second match of the day was Crunch versus Armenia. Gonna get a try. Able to close down the shot. Oh, that is a fantastic oh. goal! It was Armenia first to score, just four minutes in. It might be. And it goes! And Armenia once again to go 2-0 up. Less than 10 minutes in, and Crunch was really on the ropes. Can he find the net? Emenya had done it. Three goals without reply. The decision is offside. Crunch was saved by the narrowest of margins. And then with a real chance. Oh! Absolute screamer from Crunch. I'll tell you what, the impossible is becoming quite possible into the second half, and Crunch's hopes were still alive. That's an important intervention. And the referee has pointed to the spot. A penalty it is. Crunch couldn't afford to miss this. And he finds the net. Now Crunch back from the dead at 2-2. What else would this match bring? And that was game, set and match. Armenia notched his third and took the game. That goal is very good. Why did you make it so tight and difficult for yourself? I started getting a bit sweaty when it was 2-2 and I kept on getting those blocks or whatever, but aiming the games to win, did that, so. Crunch, talk to me. Did you lose faith when you was 2-0 down? The first three games we played, he scored on the first 10. So when I was 2 down, I was like, OK, I was just focused. Cool. Two goals came in and then, well. Yeah. Our third match of the day was Basti versus the Commoner.
Basti flew out the blocks and had a chance to take the lead. Well, he saw the whites of the keeper's eyes. Might be a chance here. Oh, no, 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 no. Can he finish? It was then the commoner's turn to go close. Great save from Basti. Can they forge ahead? Splendid defending, oh. and it needed to be. Ice cold defending from Basti. There was one last chance for the commoner. No! Oh my god! First time, you idiot. This game. Oh. Final score, nil nil. Common, we'll start with you. Mm -hmm. how, do, how do you think that? I don't even know what to say. The game I was mean, so good. I screwed up my uh, one good chance. I crossed it. I should have dribbled it and uh, had a pop myself. I was very tactical in the team I picked because I made sure that I had a good defence and a strong midfield as well. I didn't mind not scoring. I just didn't want to concede. What did you make of the game, Basti? The man is uh, defensively unbeaten so far, so... Uh... I was going for it, but he had a good finishes or in other clubs for sure. Our fourth match of the day was Javor versus Rosé. I knew it was going to be a tough match. I've played Wilf a lot, which is why you saw us do the old, uh, we, we bowed to each other, because whenever we're, we're the ones that practice and we're kind of in our dojo, as we call it. Dangerous looking through ball, and it was close. Rosé applied the pressure early on. And that was 1-0 to Rosé. He's in here. And a goal! 2-0, and Javor was hanging on by his fingernails. Rosé was showing no sign of letting up. This looks threatening. He got himself in again. Let's go! Fine finish! From and that was the third goal. 3-0 to Rosé. So the game has ended within the first half. Uh, Jason, I'm going to start with you. Do you reckon your game plan just went a bit wrong? I'm just not playing like I am yeah. in any of the games so far. Rosé, what about you? This is my first win in, the, in this competition, so it was needed. And he played really well, I'm not saying. Yeah, yeah, it's just that I don't feel like I'm playing up to my potential. Of course, of course. Well, there we have it. All the games have been played. Let's see what this does for the leaderboards. Well done, guys. With the results in, Javor and Crunch made up the bottom two places. A big win for Rosé saw him register his first points to sit at the top of the table. There's some intense battles coming up, so the guys are taking the pressure off while they still can. <laughs> I need to put less pressure on myself and have a little bit more fun. It's so hard if every day you wake up with that pressure on you. After the first eliminations, I, I understand that I need to take off this pressure for my, for my head and be more comfortable with my game. So the third round doesn't leave me in a very good standing, but I know that I have a good track record in challenges. So my goal is to win the next challenge and hopefully be able to pick my match up. Can I, can I get some celebratory uh, Pringle please for the goal? <laughs> yes sir. Yes mate. <laughs>time on making the squad. That is the stiffest gun lead I've seen in my life. There are going to be a lot of twists and turns at some point. Decisions will need to be made that are going to make people upset. First person to be going home will be...